Hey Taurus, so I'm going to do your reading. We're going to see what your messages are at this time, okay? Just keep in mind, it's general. Don't force a message to fit your situation, okay? I hope you guys are doing well. I hope everybody is taking care of themselves out there. Taurus, we're going to go ahead and start on your reading. Thank you guys for your love and your support on this channel. It really does mean a lot to me. Let's go ahead and see what your messages are at this time, okay? So we have thinking man, healer of the ages. Okay, so this person comes in peace. That's the first message I'm getting, all right? This person is coming in peace. Yeah, action is here right at the bottom of the deck. This could be um, a cancer, but I feel like whatever um, interaction they have towards you is from a peaceful place, okay? There is something on this person's mind, the thinking man, okay, some type of idea, a solution here. Appreciation is here. So this person may be coming towards you to say thank you or let you know how much they care about you, how much they appreciate you. Okay, third chakra, Archangel Chamiel. This is about um, like your personal power. This person really, okay, so this person, um... They love how confident you are. Okay, so this is like a thank you letter or a thank you message is what I'm seeing. The work that you do, they're, um, they're grateful for you, okay? Wow, okay, so this is really nice. Yeah, okay, so there could be a gift coming from this person with this blossoming abundance, okay? I feel like somebody wants to let you know just how much... Um, Wow, it kind of feels like just how much of an impact you, you're making on their life. So you could be in the business of healing people. You could be in the healthcare fields. You could be like a spiritual um, person. Whatever you do, I feel like you really help this person. Okay. Wow, look at that. This person loves you. This is going to be a very, very emotional gift that you're getting, okay? Something very, it may be very um, expensive with this blossoming abundance, but I feel like this is like a token of their appreciation for you. They really appreciate you is what I'm seeing. Yeah, seven chakra here, spirituality, okay? This is about like messages. So this could be... Um, Somebody got a download or a message about this coming in, or this is this person. Okay, so this person is coming in peace, so they're being led by spirit to give you whatever they're giving you, okay? So, this is very beautiful is what I'm seeing, a very beautiful gift, okay? It may not be like a physical gift, it doesn't have to be um, anything of like material value, but it really could be. Whatever they give you is valuable, okay? Um, this is something that for some of you, it's a gift that money can't buy, is what I'm seeing, because they really appreciate you. Wow, okay. Yeah, a conversation. So this person wants to let you know just how much you really um, affected them. So they're coming towards you. This may catch you off guard. For some of you, you may not even see this coming. Wow, okay. Holy Spirit, tell me more about this person that's coming towards the collective. This could be, you know, like a supervisor. You know, this could be someone saying like, you know, thank you so much for the impact that you make on this company. Like, I really appreciate you. You could be getting promoted. I feel like you're being blessed with something so beautiful. You're being celebrated right now. Somebody wants to let you know just how much they care about you. Holy Spirit, tell me more about this. Wow, wow. It's so beautiful. Holy Spirit, tell me more. What else does the collective need to know about this person? Nine of Swords. Okay, so for some of you, this person, they feel bad. I'm getting this energy where they feel bad about whatever happened between you two and they want to make it right. So this has been on their mind. This could be an air sign that you're connecting to, a Gemini, a Libra, an Aquarius. But there has been something, um, so it's like something has been eating this person up, okay? Whatever happened to them or whatever happened between you two, it, it, it's hard for this person to, do, to just, you know, okay. <laughs> 
Okay. Help me. <laughs> okay, it's hard for this. It may be hard for this person to speak, or it's hard for this person to just ignore what happened. They have to do something. They have to make it right, is what I'm seeing. So it's been on their mind. Like, I gotta say something. I gotta do something because I was out of pocket or I was out of character. I shouldn't have done this. Like, it's really eating this person up, okay? Tell me more, Holy Spirit. <laughs> Yeah, so Page of Wands is here. So I feel like this is that message that, you know, all of a sudden this could be coming towards you. This person is very passionate about, like, giving you this message or this gift. Holy Spirit, tell me more. Wow. Yeah, so there's a message here for sure. The Knight of Swords is here, so this is, like, quick messaging very fast paced all of a sudden like this person is apologizing or this person is you know um really wanting to make things right they're coming in peace is what i keep hearing this is a, this is a peaceful message yeah look at this <laughs> look at this this is the ten of cups and the two of cups for some of you this person that's coming in they're looking to be okay they want to be in a relationship with you okay if this is not like a romantic relationship, this is a friend. They miss their friend. For some of you, this is a friend that they, um, this is your friend, okay? Maybe you and this person had some type of falling out and they miss you. Wow. Some of you may be asking yourself, should you trust this? Because whatever happened here with that nine of swords, um, it left a bad taste in your mouth for some of you. So you're not really sure if you should accept this apology or this gift. I feel like this person really does miss you, okay? This person could be a cancer. They could be any sign, but I'm strongly picking up on cancer here. This is somebody who um, misses the connection it has not been easy not having you in their life. You make this person feel so good, okay? For some of you, this is like a friend and they miss the friendship, they miss the connection. For others of you, this could be somebody that you were dating um, or in a relationship with, a marriage with. They miss their best friend. I just see best friends here. Well, so this person may be crying. They may be very emotional when they give you this message. And I'm seeing um, for some of you, you're not really sure if you should accept this um, apology. Okay, Holy Spirit. Yeah, I'm seeing the devil card here. <sighs> okay. For some of you, it is a Cancer. It could be a Capricorn, maybe a Scorpio, a Leo. This is somebody that you have history with. You may need some time is what I'm saying. I feel like you still may need some time because um, it, maybe enough time hasn't passed. This person is really going through it though, okay? I'm, I'm strongly picking up on that. They're going through it. They're very, very emotional. This person um, going through depression, it's just, it hasn't been easy. This person, I'm just seeing a friend, okay? Like, this is somebody that you used to talk to regularly. So this person, um, you know, is somebody that, whenever they're going through anything in their life, they go to you for advice or support is what I'm seeing, and they miss that. Yeah, they definitely let a good one go for some of you, and they're realizing that now. It's like, damn, I really, it's hard not having my friend or my, you know, my person, my partner. It's, it's hard. This person has been going through some stuff. Spirit, tell me more. What else does the collective need to know about this person? This person coming in. Okay, let's see. So, they may send you a text message. All right, this may be a text message that comes in um, kind of out of the blue. I'm getting this like very, um, all of a sudden there's a message on your phone. Okay, Hierophant energy here. Taurus energy. Knight of Wands here. Three of Wands. Okay, so 
yeah this could be family as well with that um hierophant energy but i'm seeing like a history with this person you have a, a, a history but i but you're not the same either is what i'm seeing this person really hurt you you're not the same after whatever happened spirit tell me more about this uh person what else does the collective need to know about this person Holy Spirit, what else does the collective need to know about this person? Thank you. Yeah, the moon card is here. Cancer, Pisces, maybe Scorpio. For some of you, Spirit is saying, before you respond, um, use discernment. Listen to your intuition, because I'm getting this energy where you're still a little, um, your feelings are still hurt, okay? Whatever happened between you and this person, look, this is a devil energy here in the background. But whatever happened between you and this person, I feel like this really did affect you in a negative way. And it's like, for some of you, every time you think about this person, it's a bitter taste in your mouth. There is still some bitterness here, okay? The lovers, Gemini energy is coming through. The Ten of Wands is here. The Nine of Wands, this is really hard. I feel like it's really hard to... Okay, I'm seeing this two ways. It's hard to stay away from you. I'm also seeing, yeah, it's hard. So this person is saying it's hard. It has been hard staying away from you. It's been difficult, um, like, not talking to you, okay? Because they've been going through it with this Ten of Wands and this Nine of Wands. They've been struggling, okay, And whatever their situation is. And I feel like for a while they've been thinking about, like, reaching out to you. But they have been resisting it. But I feel like it's... It's to the point where they have to, like, it feels like a release is here. Like, I have to send this message. I can no longer um, hold on to this because I need my friend back or I need my person back. Somebody needs their soulmates. Like, this is a very strong connection here. Lovers here, two of cups, ten of cups. I'm also seeing for some of you, you may be resisting the urge to connect to this person because it's been a difficult process so you're not really sure listen to your intuition take some time to yourself all right tell me more about the moon holy spirit thank you the ace of coins is here so this feels like that gift It's a gift. This is like a token. Look at that. It's token here with that coin. So for some of you, it's a physical gift. You may be receiving something in the mail. And this is an apology, okay? You, Yeah, this is coming unexpected for some of you. It's a, um, uh, a package. Or a very valuable gift. Or a very sincere, heartfelt apology, okay? They love you. And I feel like... Um, Okay, there's a, there's a lot going on here. There's a lot of different layers. This is a general reading, so keep that in mind. But this person coming towards you, they really do love you. And I feel like it's just the past. That's what's holding you up. Whatever happened between you and this person in the past, you don't trust them. You don't look at them the same way. And it's hard to look at somebody in a different light when they have betrayed you or when they have intentionally made you feel a certain way. But this person is coming in peace. That's what I'm seeing, okay? So at the end of the day, it's up to you whether or not you want to work on this with this person. So take some time to yourself, okay? To really see, like, is this a connection that I want to have back in my life? Do I really love this person? Do I care for this person? Do I want to have them in my life again, spirit? What else do you need the collective to know about this person? What are their intentions for the collective? Let's see. What are their intentions, Holy Spirit?
All right, collective, sorry about that interruption. Let's see this person's intentions. <laughs> the Ace of Wands, wow. <laughs> For some of you, okay, so for some of you, these intentions are, um, I'm hearing primal, okay? For some of you, they really do just, like, they miss the sex. That could be a thing. Tell me more about this Ace of Wands, Holy Spirit. They're very, very passionate about giving you this. They want you to have something. Tell me about the, the Ace of Wands, okay? The Nine of Cups, wow, and the Ten of Pentacles here. For some of you, this is somebody who misses the relationship. They miss everything that you two used to do together. And they want to solidify this. They want to make this, uh, like they feel like this gift that they're offering you is going to um, make you happy. And it's going to lock you in. They want to lock you in is what I'm seeing, okay? <laughs> lock you in, okay. Okay, I hear that. So they want to lock you in. For some of you, this may be like a situation where they want to have a baby with you. <laughs> lock you in for life. So, you know, just be mindful. I would just say be mindful. Okay. Be, be mindful if that's not what you're trying to do. <laughs> this person is trying to lock you in. <laughs> wow. People are funny. Okay, but that's this person. For some of you, that's, you know, that's for some of you. All right, let's see. Um... Let's get into angel answers and I'm going to wrap this up. <laughs> Holy Spirit, what else does a collective need to know about this person? Any other advice? Any other messages about this person, Holy Spirit? Any other advice? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, so be assertive, all right? Yeah, okay, so I feel like Spirit needs you to stay on your ground, okay? Or, you know... Speak your truth. Say what your say what's on your heart. Say how you feel. Don't sugarcoat anything. Don't um don't allow your Okay. Um for some of you there's a need for you to ask certain questions. There's a need for you to get to the bottom of things, or there's a need a need for you to understand whatever happened between you two you may be asking this person questions so i feel like spirit is saying go ahead and ask questions all right so you can get a feel for this person tell me more holy spirit so we have be assertive what else what else does a collective no no <laughs> what else does a collective need to know about this person what other advice or other messages thank you spirit Take action is here. Wow, for some of you, you may have sex with this person, okay? Spirit wants you to be, you know, aware of what you're doing, okay? You may need to wrap things up, okay? That's always a good thing to do, especially if you haven't dealt with this person in so long, okay? This person, um, I feel like they're very assertive, and I feel like you need to, okay, <laughs> because this person is coming towards you and really wanting to lock you in, okay? And some of you may not be so sure about what you want from this person or if you want this person like that. So be, you know, take the steps that you need to take to protect yourself is what I'm seeing. One more Holy Spirit. Because this person is coming towards you and they have a mission to lock you in. Get their friend back, get their person back. You know, they want you back. I'm also seeing if this is work related, um, this is a company that wants to lock you in. Okay, you may not wanna be here long term at this company, so state your ground, you know, let these people know what you're looking for, what you want, what you're not, you know, willing to settle for. Be as clear as possible. One more Holy Spirit. Can I have one more for the collective? Just one more. One more. Thank you, Spirit. Remain positive. I feel like this person is coming in peace. This offer, whatever this is, it is a it is a sincere offer. Okay, um, so just keep that in mind. But <laughs> yeah, I see improving health here at the bottom of the deck. At the end of the day, it's always up to you. 
But that's the reading. I hope it was helpful. If so, you can like, share, and subscribe. If you're interested in a personal reading, I am available. You can email me. It's in the description box below. Also, don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that you can see when I upload readings. You guys take care, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.